Welcome! Today we're making an all-weather Christmas present hack for outdoor decoration. We've had some requests from viewers to make a weatherproof Christmas present hack, so we have. We appreciate your support. Please hit subscribe and like. So to frame the present, we've got these square wreath forms, and they're $1.50 each at Dollar Tree. Oh, here's my handy assistant, Harry. Say hi, Harry. And you'll need six of those painted white. We decided just to make one big present, but if you wanted to make three different size presents, you could by cutting the form. Because we're just using metal frames and zip ties, the present should withstand almost any kind of weather. So to put our frames together, we put the curved part on the inside of the present, and we put a zip tie in each corner just to connect everything together. Then we'll just repeat that process until we have the outside of the box. Then we'll place the other side on the top and the bottom and zip tie each corner onto the other side of the box. It is a pretty easy project, so give it a try. The cost of this project comes in around $15 compared to our Lowe's present hack, which was $5 each, but this one is weatherproof. So once your tops and bottoms and sides are all done, just snip off the ends of those zip ties so you have a nice clean look and try to rotate the little nibs inside. Then you could take those little zip tie nibs, put them together and give them a little dab of hot glue to keep them in place. We used six inch wide decorative mesh for this project and it gave it a really nice plaid look. It also gives the present a lot more strength and durability. Please check out our other DIY present videos. We decorated this whole present with mesh, but if you wanted to put lights in it, it would probably be best to leave the bottom open. Next, we'll put on our ribbon, just glue one end of it down, come up to the next level, glue that, and keep going around the present till it's all wrapped up. Then for the bow, you'll get a long piece, fold it in half, glue in the middle, and fold each end into the center to make one part of the bow. And you'll repeat that process with another piece, so you'll have two pieces of the bow. Then you'll take those two pieces of the bow, make a cross, put that in the middle like that, make a little loop with another piece of scrap ribbon for the center, put that in the middle sort of against the green there, perfect. And there's your bow. Then to attach the bow to the present, just find the center, glue that on there, put the ribbon toward the corners, and you'll have a nice little Xy bow. And depending on your weather, if you want more strength, just add a little more glue. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.